Hi guys, Will you and Plivo are two software solutions that help businesses and developers carry out personalized interactions with companies across multiple channels. But which one should you be using? To help you make an informed decision, I will explain the main differences between Plivo and Twilio and will consider 5 criteria to see how these two tools suck up. And thank you for using the links in the description. So let's find out which one is better for you. The difference between Plivo and Twilio is that Plivo only offers programmable SMS APIs, while Twilio also offers conversational messaging APIs with known SMS channels like WebChat, WhatsApp, and Facebook Messenger. Twilio offers more channels, Twilio offers two-way conversational messaging and locking new use cases, Plivo offers forward SMS to email, and Twilio doesn't publish a list of countries to which you can make calls or send messages, Plivo's published coverage pages for its voice and SMS APIs shows that you can communicate with people virtually anywhere on Earth. Plivo covers over 190 countries. However, the two platforms are comparable in terms of the areas they cover. And for the features, Twilio and Plivo are comparable in terms of the features each offers. Both provide a voice API, messaging API, SIP tracking, and phone number rental for long calls toll-free numbers, and short codes. Twilio also offers video and email integration. In recent years, Twilio has gone on an acquisition spree, so the company also offers a number of applications that are not integrated into its communications platform. Plivo has begun launching applications on top of its API platform with the recent introduction of its homegrown Contact to Cloud Message Center. And for the analytics and the reporting, from your Twilio contact center, you can access real-time dashboards and historical reports. These are displayed as visual graphs and text-based tables. The dashboard displays the following real-time reports. Overview, graph and statistical displays of incoming and outgoing messages, including the percentage of received versus failed messages. Delivery and errors, source delivery data into three views, message delivery sortable by status, message error codes, and total messages divided into delivery categories. And responses. View inbound messages and customer responses to your outbound messages, including opt-ins, opt-outs, help requests, and other. Aside from the dashboards and historical reports, you can get insights using the TaskCruiser event stream and TaskCruiser statistics APIs. Some of the insights you get include frequent customer summary, inbound statistics, Task Abundant Reports, Hourly Usage, Tasks by Day, Daily Traffic, Task Duration Summary, and Agent Summary. You can view your call and SMS reports from the Plivo console. However, these reports are not integrated into one dashboard. You can access call reports from Android Logs under the Voice API dashboard, while SMS MMS reports are available under the Messaging API dashboard. Nevertheless, you can easily switch between bots by selecting their menus on the console. Under call logs, you can view reports on call details, call relations, call stats, and audio quality stats. For SMS, you can get details on inbound and outbound messages including their dates, sender, number, country, status, and costs. You can also get an overview report from the home dashboard of each API. Each message includes a debug report displaying transactional details to help developers troubleshoot messaging errors. So, on Twilio, you can access your reports and insights from one dashboard. Plivo features individual reports for each API. And for the message personalization and flexibility, Plivo supports JSM and Unicode character formats, allowing communication with customers in any language, including Chinese, Japanese, Arabic, emojis, and symbols. MMS-rich communication supports enable sending and receiving images, video, and audio. Messages over 160 characters are automatically concatenated, built as separate messages, but delivered as a single message. These features personalize customer messaging, sticky sender, use a consistent phone number or sender caller ID across interactions with the same customer. Local match, Plivo auto selects a customer's local area number for outbound messages to increase read rates. To will use programmable messaging APIs support sticky sender, local geo match, long message concatenation, 
multiple character sets and rich content, plus the ability to send long messages as MMS to reduce costs. Schedule transactional messages beforehand, predetermining the exact days and time for the API call. Further, Twilio's Conversations API really shines in providing an omnichannel messaging experience for one or multiple customers at once. Conversational messaging enables agents and multiple participating customers to maintain one conversation across business SMS, MMS, web chats, WhatsApp, Google Business Messenger, and Facebook Messenger. The Conversational Messaging API features include delivery statuses and read recepts, scalable conversations, custom attributes, so you can customize the sending user, the recipients, and the message itself for full control over what each message says and where it goes. Scoped webhooks, so you can easily assign a Twilio Studio flow to a particular conversation to escalate or root it. Conversation history, maintain each customer's conversation history to agents retain full context. And also conversation states and timers, mark conversations as active, inactive or closed and set a conversation expiration timeout. And for the developer support tools, generally, all Twilio features are programmable including SMS, voice, WhatsApp, email, SuperSIM, Verify, and SIP trunking APIs. However, the standout Twilio feature for developers is Twilio Flex. Twilio Flex is a programmable cloud contact center platform. From here, developers can control all Twilio features they deploy. As a developer, you can build your dream customer contacts channel and experience for your customers using themes, templates, and the drag and drop builder. With Twilio Flex, you can deploy your contact center using tools like Flex Insights, the plugin builder, and Flex UI. Already, Twilio's API docs include quick start guides, code snippets that developers can plug in, tutorials, and a resource library to support building across languages. Java, C, Python, Ruby, Node.js, PHP, CURL, and Twilio CLI. Plevo high-level objects makes building channels using Plevo's APIs very easy for developers. It's a drag-and-drop builder, so you can build a customer contact center without needing to code. Simply drag and arrange the building blocks as you want. There are Plevo high-level object templates with pre-built workflows, so you can skip developing from scratch. You can simply customize the workflows after importing the templates. You will find templates to build voice notifications, alerts, SMS alerts, SMS autoresponder, and more. Some features of Plevo high-level objects include the component library, unique nodes, triggers, configuration, and information tabs. For developer features, it's a draw as Plevo high-level objects and Twilio Flex is similar. Both are drag-and-drop builders with templates and they work with their native APIs. And for the pricing, both platforms provide offer pay-as-you-go messaging and monthly phone number rental options with volume and committed spend discounts. Pricing is a clear differentiator between Twilio and Plevo. The cost of sending and receiving SMS and MMS messages and voice calls is considerably lower with Plevo. The more calls you make and messages you send, the more cost-effective Plevo becomes. Most SMS carriers add an additional surcharge to send or receive messages. While Plevo's native plans do not include WhatsApp or two-way conversational messaging, they offer a separate omnichannel solution called Contacto, which includes WhatsApp messaging as well as two-way conversational chat. In addition to the pay-as-you-go programmable messaging rates, Twilio's conversational messaging API starts at $0.05 cents per month per active user and $0.25 cents per month per gigabyte of storage. So, choosing between Plevo and Twilio depends on your business and your needs. The better service provider depends on your company's budget and intended use cases. Twilio supports more use cases and more channels, but Plevo offers more affordable pricing. Other than that, it's up to you. So yeah, that's it for this video. You can check the links in the description, that helps a lot, thank you. So hopefully this video helped you out, if it did, leave a comment and click the like button, that helps too, and bye bye.